A group of six hikers are safe today thanks to rescue efforts by the Sedona Fire Department. Reportedly, one of the hikers injured himself while hiking above the West Fork hiking trail along Oak Creek Canyon Saturday, effectively stranding the group high in the cliffs above Oak Creek. The hikers were eventually rescued by helicopter on Sunday. Despite having a GPS tracker device, search crews had a difficult time locating the group and even had to sleep in the rain Saturday night. Stephanie Frater King has the details. Last Saturday, a hiker was injured in Illusion Canyon. Luckily, they had their personal locator beacon, a GPS that directs officials to their direct location. However, the GPS sent the crew to the wrong canyon. Originally, the information that we got and the personal locator beacon signal showed them as being in Insomnia Canyon, which is one canyon to the west. One local hiker explains that although GPS trackers can be very helpful in hiking, they aren't always exact. You don't necessarily get a really clear satellite signal, so it can give you a general location, but it won't necessarily pinpoint exactly where you are, which comes back to the importance of letting people know where you're going from the get-go and being able to be self-sufficient should anything go wrong. Um, some of them can have preloaded messages into them uh, that you can send to certain individuals. Some of them are just going to activate a rescue. Uh, so there's a kind of a wide variety of different types. Just because you activate one of these types of personal locator beacons does not mean that there's going to be a rapid response and a, and a rapid extrication. You know, in this instance, it was uh, 19 hours of, uh, of rescue that it took in order to actually uh, complete the mission. So the question is, should hikers be using these personal locator beacons? I would say that it is a good idea for hikers to have these if they're doing, um, you know, extensive backcountry type things because um, without it, you know, you would need to send somebody um, to hike out or something like that in order to be able to notify uh, a rescue response, whereas this at least gets the alert happening and starts the ball rolling so that resources can start to gather that data that they need. For NAZ Today, I'm Stephanie Frederking.